We're cartooning today and we talked about the face, emotion, age, body, clothing. Now we're going to talk about props. As you can see, I've left up my little French chef character from last time and I drew him with a closed fist. And he looks like he's holding something. Well, let's make him even more of a chef and add something that he's holding. What is a chef going to be holding? I don't know. Maybe like a spatula or something? Another prop what we could have right next to him. He's got a big vat of stew. I don't know why he needs a spatula for that. Maybe he needs a ladle. But now we've got little water going on. We've got a bubbly pot of stew going on. I'm starting to get a little hungry. See the little scent lines coming up? Ah, magnifique. Basically, we got little props going on, and props are anything, it's basically a term for anything that you would have in a day-to-day -day basis. If you were to draw a picture of your mom on the telephone, hey, that telephone, there's the receiver, that's a prop. A little curly line going down. So anything you see in real life, a globe, a computer, hey, let's draw a television. It's an old-fashioned one with some rabbit ears. The guy's going to be upset because he realizes that you have to get Comcast or you're not going to get any uh, signals coming in. So he's getting a lot of snow on that TV, I think. And there's a little speaker so he can hear the snow. And those are props.